Hey guys, Alex Carey here, going over tomorrow's workout. I'm gonna have Carey show the warm up, and we'll get moving with this. So we're gonna open up with 50 high knees. So just in place, getting those knees nice and high. We go 50 per side. Uh, 10 leg swings, forward to back, and then side to side, each leg. Uh, next, we'll go into a deep lunge. So driving that knee as far forward as you guys can, keeping that heel down if possible and then dropping our elbows down, just trying to get into a super, super deep lunge. Hold for like five or 10 seconds, switch sides. We'll then do some um, weighted ankle mobility. So whatever weight you guys have, uh, prop that on top of your knee. We're driving that knee forward and then out towards our pinky toe. If you wanna hit different angles with it too, towards your big toe, that's fine. But just make sure you're getting that ankle warmed up and driving that knee as far forward as you can. Still keeping that heel down. We'll next do 20 second, uh, weighted squat. So we're gonna hold on to some sort of weight, um, go into a super deep squat, uh, hold that for 20 seconds, driving our knees out, keeping that chest up, and feet are flat. Uh, we'll do 10 hip thrusts next. So we're gonna be on our back, feet flat on the ground. Go ahead and back up more here. Yeah, so, so feet flat on the ground, driving our hips up. You guys wanna make it a little bit harder. You can raise one leg up or cross it over the other leg. Really, really working on squeezing your glutes and driving those hips as high as you guys can. We'll then hop up, do 10 body weight squats. So normal squat here, driving our knees far out, abs really tight, getting super deep. And then we'll practice our Curtis P's for the workout today. So Curtis P is gonna be a power clean, uh, lunge with right, lunge with left, and then a push press overhead. Uh, we'll, we'll start with the barbell. And so from mid shin or with, with uh, weight on the bar, the bar's on the ground. Point through our hips, full power clean, uh, front rack position, lunge left, lunge right, and then a push press. So dip, dip and drive, um, big drive from our hips, but very shallow dip. We do that with dumbbells, kettlebells, um, even a wall ball if you guys want. Uh, yeah, with those power cleans, holding the dumbbells on the outside of our legs, power clean, lunge, lunge, push press. And so that's uh, a big portion of our wad today. Um, so get a few of those into practice. For our strength today, we're doing back squats. Um, week four of 11. So we're in our Chateau Wendler base cycle. Uh, it's a deload week this week, and then next week we'll go back to a, a kind of four week cycle. Um, big thing for next week is you're adding 10 pounds to your previous max if you were following through with this cycle. And so deload today, next week, same percentages, but you're adding 10 pounds to your max. So your weights will go up a little bit. Back squats. Bars down our back, pulling the, the bar down into our back. Abs really tight, driving our knees far out. Just making sure we have a strong base and our feet are flat during those squats. So essentially a five by five, but most of it's working up today. Uh, if you guys don't have a barbell uh, and, a, and a lot of weight at home, uh, our strength today is gonna open up with some Bulgarian squats or split squats. And so Bulgarian is gonna be um, toe on the bench, trying to drop about to parallel, um, not necessarily bringing that knee down to the ground, uh, and then adding some weight if you guys can, whether on your shoulders or holding down to the sides. Split lunge will just be essentially a split jerk catch position, and you're holding that position, just driving up and back down, not walking through each rep. So we'll do three sets of eight there. Uh, after that, we're gonna do five sets of a weighted squat, weighted box step up, and then 50 meter carry. So we did this last week as well. So just getting as much weight on your body as possible. For six squats, we'll do three uh, weighted step ups per leg. And then we'll do a heavy carry, about 50 meters, packing on as much weight as you guys can. We'll do five sets of that. Okay, so just time under, time under tension with that weight. For our wad today, we have a couple different sections. So the wad today is called Meltdown. We're gonna open up with a five minute AMRAP of 11 box jumps and five Curtis P's. So weight shouldn't be too heavy um, for this, this first round. You are adding weight as you guys go, but uh, box jumps, we're jumping onto a box with both feet getting on top or you can do steps like we did in the strength. Uh, and then we'll do Curtis P's. So we're doing power clean, lunge, lunge, push press, five cycles of that. We're gonna rest one minute after that five minute AMRAP. We're gonna do five minutes of, so less box jumps and less Curtis P's, but the weight's heavier. So nine box jumps, four Curtis P's, five minutes of that, one minute rest, 
five minutes again. Seven box jumps, three Curtis B's, weights heavier, the reps are going down. No rest, we're gonna end with max handstand push-ups. Okay, so 20 minute time for handstand push-ups. Carrie's getting overhead, or upside down, I mean. Um, with, with those handstand push-ups, we wanna think about our fingers pointing towards the outside of our body and thumbs pointing towards the back wall. Uh, that's gonna drive our elbows the, 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 the right direction that we want them to, okay, going back, and uh, put us in a good position, keeping a tripod position with our head and our hands. So, uh, otherwise, we can do a pike push up. Um, so, hips are high, same position with our hands. We're driving our head towards our fingertips and then pushing up and back into that down dog type position. So, for at home standards, same movements, same stuff, just use dumbbells, kettlebells, any sort of weight that you guys have. If you have the means, start lighter and then go heavier as you can. Otherwise, keep to this rep scheme and just bust through these rounds uh, as fast as you guys can. So, um, have an awesome workout. Have a great time tomorrow. Um, see you guys, love you. Okay, you're so badass.